Hi everyone, this is Stock Signals Philippines teaching how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently. This is our top gainer and top loser analysis for August 24, 2017. Our top gainer for the day is actually OPMB but I didn't take that one because it only had 69 trades while this one had 504 tra trades. So let's take a quick look at the financials. FES had a net income of 2.67 million in 2016 for 2017. First half it has a net income of 774,000. That's actually good versus a loss of 15 million last year for the first half of 2016. EPS though is still too small so we cannot compute PE ratio. Book value is at 0.73, so with a price of 0.59, the stock is still undervalued. Let's look at the chart of FES. Okay, it seems the stock is actually making uh, higher highs and higher lows in the short term. It's a breakout above this expected resistance at 0.56. 15 EMA and 20 SMA is acting as support. We have decent volume in the breakout. Not that explosive, but it's still noteworthy. MACD is poised for a bullish crossover. RSI is also bullish, but not yet in overbought territory. The support is at 0 0.56, followed by 0 0.52, while resistance is at 0 0.62. Our top loser is NRCP, down 6.67%. Uh, NRCP. P had a net income of 78 million in 2016. For 2017, the stock seems to have booked a loss of 15 million in the first half, but this is again better than the 18 million in 2016. So we have a negative EPS for the current year, so let's not compute PE. Book value is at 2.39. With a price of 0.98, stock is uh, clearly undervalued P to B V wise. Okay. Let's look at the chart of NRCP. Okay, it's pulling back. Uh, volume. The good thing about this one is the volume is also shrinking on the way down, which could signify a healthy correction. Uh, your moving averages 15 and 20 SMA are still bullish to 20 SMA. About to do a bullish crossover versus the 50 SMA, MACD is bullish. RSI is relieving overbought levels, currently at 60 RSI. Immediate support is at 0.975, followed by 0.94, while resistance is at 1.07. So that's NRCP. Alright, that was your top winner and top loser analysis for August 24, 2017. This is Stock Signals Philippines teaching you how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently.